service groups, OMD. So I'm actually going to have the president of OMD to come and talk a little bit about why we're here. So let's give a hand for Joshua Escobedo.
you know, I used to think that I could get high and uh, be successful at the same time, right? You know, and I was struggling, you know, like an arm wrestler, right? And, uh, you know, you try to fight me on an arm wrestler. <laughs> don't, don't beat me just to pretend, like make some faces, right? Like, right, you know? So he represents my conflict. Right? Poor Josh. <laughs> <laughs> right, you know, uh, you know, and I heard that term surrender. Right, so I'm trying to be successful while I'm fighting this addiction, you know, and then, and then uh, in reality, all I had to do was just give up, you know, just accept it, and then and, and I could let it go, and now, now I'm not struggling with him, with him to walk past it, you know. Now I put it down, I surrendered, I gave it up to the fight. I'm not trying to beat something I can't beat anymore, and I'm able to walk past it. You know? And uh, even though I know you guys are not addicted to crystal men, you know, I was, and the the whole idea is that we all have conflict, and the way to get past it is just surrender. You know, give up, give up to this this um, thing that's. If you do have a, a, a conflict, if it's bothering you, you know, and move past it. And, and so I, I started down a journey. That, uh, you know, it was a road to, uh, to somewhere I didn't have any idea where it would take me. And, you know, I know if I could go, I could go out and rob somebody or. You know, go and get high, and then I would feel better or, or have money to do things. But it's not the right thing. That was a selfish life I led. And uh, you know, one day I just woke up and I, I surrendered, and I opened my heart, and I was I, I came to Pasadena City College, and I started uh, volunteering with Alpha Gamma Sigma and Mecha and OMD, and uh, just great, beautiful things started happening. You know. It's when we live an unselfish life that we're able to, to grow and advance and be successful. And, uh, you know, a lot of us, we've all gone through a lot of tough times. You know, my parents moved away and for two years they didn't even tell me where they lived. That's how bad it was, you know. And, uh, my family, they were scared of me. You know, I had, I had nowhere to go. But when I came to Pasadena City College, you know, things just started to open up and, and Something happened in here, something, I started studying, and I don't know where it's going to take me, and I don't know where it'll take you, but if you just keep trying, you know, every footstep you take in the right direction, God will give you another one, you know? Success. And so we're here today to recognize uh, students who have met the requirements for our honor society. We managed to raise $1,100 for you guys, and uh, we have 24 awards. Um, we divided it up evenly, and, um, you know, you should be very proud of where you're at today. That's right. Uh, it's not easy to get here. You know, there's so many other people outside of this room, this room right now, who have no idea what it's like to hit that little accomplishment, that level of success, right? And uh, so I just want to say thank you for helping, helping us make this a success, you know? <clears throat> right, if it wasn't for the bad times, nothing would be good, right? So uh, we're here to celebrate a good day. It's a good day, a beautiful day. And I just want to say thank you and congratulations to everybody who made the met the requirements. Congratulations. So I have one more thing. If I could have any OMD members please stand. Um, these people here are here to support you. Uh, and they're also OMD members. There are over hundreds and hundreds of OMD members throughout the student body and faculty and staff. So you never know who's an OMD member, and just remember, we always we always keep an eye out for new members each semester. So once more, congratulations to each and one of you students. Continue the hard work. Continue to get more involved in your community. Get involved in your school, and once you hit, once you get that piece of paper that says you have a bachelor's degree of something, then you can raise that high proudly and say, "I did it." Thank you.